Hey guys, welcome back to episode 9, I think this is. Um, we are going to have some more fun beating up with the silly Frenchman down here, Mr. Napoleon. And I'm looking around at this map, and I'm thinking... Or, excuse me, not the map, but looking at the tech tree here. And, you know, I got replaceable parts right here. I'm kind of thinking... Might not be a bad idea to take replaceable parts here and then go down to dynamite and, uh, like, burn another scientist. Uh, because I have this spare one here from, uh, Faith Purchasing. I'm gonna get one, you know, bitch Faith Purchasing. Although that may go into order for something, I don't know what. I may in get an engineer, but the question would be what I do with it. Um, you know, the pop one in Seoul, and then Helsinki will come shortly after that. Uh, those may be the last two, actually. But I still have Oxford sitting around. So, basically, I have four scientists for, uh, to come through this game. And Oxford as well. So, even though it's only three turns, I'm thinking if I could burn, um, uh, a green scientist here to get, uh, replaceable parts faster and capitalize great war infantry, that might not be a bad plan. Because you could go on down through, like I said, use the bolt to help out with um, um, artillery as well. Which I'm going to need to break through here, because Paris is... It's not so much that it has anyone to fence, it's, it's on the coast. So there's going to be a lot of stupid... Um, uh, probably there's going to be a lot of stupid ships down there. They're going to really give me some problems. Although, yeah, I don't want to do it this turn because I don't have any money to upgrade with, so that would kind of be pointless. So I may just actually wait this out and see how it comes after that. Let's see, yeah, these bombers are gonna. Um. Oh, come on. This is cruel. Okay, there we go. Got those guys down. Uh, yeah, you're gonna run away. So is this guy. Uh, yeah, we're trying to get a road to Levento, but Levento is not cooperating, <laughs> so that's a little bit of a pain in the butt. Yeah, you guys can just stay there. Um, okay, okay, we need to fix that coal up first, and I need to. I want to actually get a road going here between uh, Constantinople and Orid. And also, I was thinking originally, I was planning to go up here and liberate Ragusa. But I got thinking that's gonna give a lot, a good bit of food to my puppets. I think it's like plus two food at this point in the game. Th yeah, I can just kiss goodbye to all my happiness if I have a, like an extra two pop or one or two pop coming in every one of these stupid puppets here. That would be a real pain in the butt. Well, I, mean, I don't need a huge amount of that excess happiness, but I need enough to... I just need to be above one. Or above minus one, rather. So I can actually, uh... Still have the rationalism bonus, is the thing. Because I don't have that, well, yeah. That's gonna suck. Big time. Oh, come on. Give me a break here. Oh, right, I have... Oh, the bombers are way out of range, though. That's not gonna work. Yeah. What can I do here? Hmm. I can't... Nah, he can't take that out. That's an actual hill. Uh, let's give you air repair. I'll come back and deal with that later. So you have air repair. So let's put a medic guy next to you. Uh, let's let the truck only take this guy out. Ow. Oh. There we go. And now that guy. Uh, see, I'm really tempted to do this. I really want to get this guy out of here. But. Okay. Uh, he may or may not make that out of there. That's going to be like 55 health. Can I get a medic in here for him? Yes, I can. Okay. Actually, this would be much better, because, yeah, now he can zone the control, kind of. Well, maybe not really, but he can at least draw some a little bit of uh, attention from these guys. Which is the point, since... Yeah, it's also good the, the general over here, which actually would have made a difference if I had thought to bring the guy over there. That's the problem, that's the thing about uh, when you drop a citadel, 
you gotta make sure your show degree general, so you gotta make sure you're covering everyone, which I failed to make sure of. Oops. Oh, come on, Laventa. Really? Actually, no, that's dumb. I don't need to be able to roll there. I just need to move your stupid guys out of there. Um. Uh, okay, that works. Let's see. Okay, you guys wait here. Who's the medic, actually? Hang on. Okay, sorry about that. Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave these cannons back here. <coughs> Two for when I get up to dynamite. And I think actually since I have the money now, I'm gonna go ahead and just ball the scientist. Okay, so fertilizer, yeah, I got some the uh actually yeah, let's do the military science first. So now these guys, I'm just gonna go ahead and upgrade this guy and this guy and I might have that guy. Not quite for that guy. So Yeah, again the point was not so much to uh capitalize on just the Great War Patrol, but it's to have the Great War Patrol and the um, artillery a bit faster as well. Okay, so that worked out well. <clears throat> and now these guys should be able to march down to Leon pretty well, because as you can see, they're kind of beasts. <laughs> Yeah, uh, cover two, march, manic, siege, yeah. This is this guy, shock two, oof. Oh, hey buddy, what's up? <laughs> yeah, you can see Major Victory even, that's without the Grid General nearby. Uh, let's take this guy down, there we go. Also, fun fact, I didn't realize this until the other day, uh, El Dorado counts as a mountain. So you can't actually shoot around it or over it, which is kind of annoying if you're not prepared for it. If you plan this, if you play everything out, then it's like, oh, I can't attack there. I felt a little dumb when that happened <laughs> in a different game. <laughs> actually, did that happen in this game? I want to say I had a unit around here somewhere. I couldn't shoot over it. I don't know. Point is, it's like a mountain. It's kind of silly. Um, now the question is how far do we want to put this guy in? Push this guy in? I don't think I want to push him that far in. I think I want to get the bomber over here before I do anything like that. So they can help support uh, a chip out a few riflemen. Or anything comes flying in from over uh, Chartres down there, or whatever's down there. Orleans, I would assume. So the city I haven't seen yet, I think. So. Yeah, you don't really help me here in Leventa. Sorry. <laughs> Oh, right, the medic just... Oh, actually, well, they're right, they moved, so it's okay. Uh, yeah, you can go up there. Oh, for the the road there. Oh, well. Um... Following trade of interest to you. Sure, you actually have money now, too. That's nice. Oh, camera fared out. Uh, fitted again? How about no? And that's something I was looking at uh, between... Sure. Uh, between uh, videos, I do that sometimes. I just, you know, I look over the map, I look over the social policies, detect how things are going. And I realized, I kind of, I thought for a minute about going autocracy just to be cute. <laughs> and see if I could get honor and autocracy to work. But I really need the happiness, which is the biggest problem with autocracy. You don't get happiness from it. Which is like the biggest need of the domination game. Like, yeah, you have police state. That's that's it. And that requires you to annex and build a freaking courthouse. AKA, uh, yeah, does not help with the puppets over here. Um, but the point of that was, he, I think, was it him? Who, yeah, it was him. Uh, Soul and Mama in order. So if he's order and I go autocracy, yeah, that would might push him over the edge of downing me, which he's kind of thinking about doing right now, I think. But I don't think he quite has the he's got not quite gotten the balls up to do it yet, because he sees yeah I have enough of the military that I could give him a problem if he tried that. So that's what's keeping him at bay right now. Okay, so let's just go ahead and upgrade these last couple um 
Carolians, two great war infantry. Here we go. So yeah, we have air recon now, so we can see through here. And let's just oh whoops. That was not what I meant to do, actually. I meant to trash the uh <laughs> the cannon there. If it was something, so would have gotten it right. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of stuff, but oh well. Let's go ahead and move a couple of these guys in. By couple, I mean a bunch of guys. And let's just get the uh, Gatling guns in here to back them up. Yeah, only seven damage to Orleans, or Leon. Uh, yeah, these guys can back up, and they can also upgrade, I think. Yes, they can. It's not awesome. Uh, reinforcements coming in from that direction. That'll be nice to have. Actually, yeah, you should get up in the hill and finish that ruin that way first. There we go. Thank you, Lopenta. Let's do a route 2, so I don't have to go back and micromanage that later. Go away, Theo. I have made you a non-factor in this, so shut up. <laughs> Your crit war machine was two damage was bombarded by enemy cannon. Get out. <laughs> Give it up. Okay, so there's that one, the scientist from Seoul. Uh, let's try to peace work him up here, because Vatican City is a thing. Honestly, more threatening than Napoleon is, I think, at this point. Uh, yeah, let's give you air repair here. Um, oh no, a scout. What am I gonna do? Can you trash this guy? Ah, oh, not quite. Breaking my balls here, Mr. Orid. Yeah, let's use these guys to take down the cannons. This is gonna goofy, but whatever. <laughs> and uh, though I wouldn't bother doing this, yeah, might as well. Okay, nothing really over there. That's fine. It's got a good attack, but the the damage would probably just get healed off from the uh, the city healing up. It's probably not worthwhile to do that. Um. You have cover too, but you can't click it in there yet. Let's move you onto the road first. This is a power of leaves though, or rifles if you didn't upgrade enough. Yeah. 76 defense city, safe attack. I would take 26 damage, I would heal off. Well, I wouldn't heal any off, I would heal 10 off because I didn't position the medic here properly. Oops. Um, but you get the point. Because this, yeah, that's a double medic right there. If I positioned these properly, that would be kind of ridiculous. So these guys can fly up here and just at least scare him off. Let's bring a couple of these more guys in here. Yeah, you can come in. Actually, you can work. You have double medic. You don't have cover, but there's not going to be any real right attacks. It's going to be these, but you know, whatever. Not going to really do a whole lot of damage to this guy. Alright, now you get the red going there. There we go. So I'll have max policy anyway. Six turns. I only took in the city states. Uh, yeah, I can't undo. Eh. Did I move the oh I moved the general up there, that's right, because I sacrificed the other one. Or wait. Did I? You know list. Um Oh, yeah, there you are right there. Dar. And actually, this I realized once, yeah, once Souls done with that, I'm gonna try to crank out some a couple of units because this is the downside of having military tradition in it or uh, military cast as your one of your happiness policies. Uh, you start moving stuff around, and the happiness kind of goes away if you don't build enough scouts early on, which I kind of forgot about until you know the term before scientific theory came up and I absolutely needed them. Uh, probably, in hindsight, probably should have put that off like one turn and build a couple more scouts. Oh well. Yeah, Mr. Great Warp Tree here is not taking a lot of damage. Oh hey, he brought his own. So it's probably a good idea to ball this because he's got his own, uh, his four legions, which are actually not very dangerous because it's not foreign territory. <laughs> well, okay, they're still dangerous, but they're not going to make me pee my pants like they would might otherwise. 
Uh, especially since I can do this and just kind of make it look a little silly. Good night. Uh, yeah, Mr. Trump is going to die if he does that, so let's not do that. Uh, yeah, you can pillage this. And actually, we won't get there. Well, these guys should probably have swap places or something. I don't know. Yeah, you could just smack him with this on the head, but you could set up like Orleans. That would not be a uh, good outcome there. Uh, let's do this, actually. You have shock, so... You do could smack the city. You could take the chunk out of it. Good job there. So we have two choices. We could done here for combustion. We can combine. We could rush the Pentagon. That would just be goofy. Or I think we want to go atomic theory here. Just to make sure we can actually get... See, we have uranium and nukes and all that stuff. And plus, infantry, which honestly shouldn't really be there in the tech tree. It should honestly be off. Either Great War infantry should be like a tech back, or... Well, no. Honestly, plastics... Infantry should probably be up at like radar or something. Probably not penicillin, because that's just, that's just a pain in the ass to go in the tech tree. You gotta go with refrigeration, which you might not go otherwise, and it's just... Ugh. Like, why do you want to put the... I would not put a military tech up there, up at refrigeration. Because you got, like, subs, submarines up there, that's that's it. This doesn't make a lot of sense. I'm just going to go for the great war, great war infantry, then, hey, two techs later, hey, they're obsolete. Now, what you got here? Uh, that's certainly a thing. Nothing that I have no interest in, but it's a thing nonetheless. Yeah, it is kind of ridiculous when you're... A 78 strength oligarchy boosted city is only doing 21 damage to your, uh, Great War Infantry. I'm gonna close that tile. Let's, um... Let's just think about this. Okay, well, the Gatlinger's gonna shoot the city. Um, can this, how much does Bomber do this lancer? Okay, he can just, yeah, he can blow him the heck up. That works. So you guys are free to shoot at that city. Uh, this cannon is just being goofy, I guess. The <laughs> probably can't take him out in one shot, but he can actually do his damage to them. This guy can blow him up. There we go. Yeah, let's do that. Get to you in open territory. Open terrain, which is your street anyway. Yeah, these guys can just smack Leon again. Let's, let's actually fortify this guy. Because he's blocking the uh, the choke point here. And let's have that guy just smack the rifleman. Make sure he stays down. Yeah, okay, we'll move him around that way. Alright, I have, um... Duh. Uh, I forgot to finish Dynamite. <laughs> Let's go ahead and upgrade those guys. Alright, so let's see. So, um... Yeah, I do need to create a unit out of the garrison, but it's going to take forever on all these. And they're really something I want to garrison. So let's have you work on artillery. Grip more bomber. That's what we've done in Helsinki, so you can jump over there faster. Hey, you're done too. Nice. Let's jump you up the tours. Um... Yeah, uh, what do you gonna work on? Where are you gonna work on, rather? Um, let's give you, let's do another war bomber, I guess. I'm not overly concerned about the happiness right now, because I'm gonna be getting, um, the happiness from order, so that doesn't concern me too much at the moment. Besides, I think I still have some theaters and stuff I can build, like, yeah, I got the theater in Helsinki I can still build, although I think I built the other ones already. Yeah, I built the other ones, but, oh well. We have other methods of happiness, so. Let's see, we can, if we need to, we can just crank some more units out for military cast. It's not that big a deal. Yeah, we'll slow my production on a little bit. I just don't want to do it if I... I can do it, I just don't want to do it if I don't have to do it. And that was kind of goofy, because he got left with the one next to him. Okay, that works. 
Although he wasn't in trouble in the first place, so I guess. Um. Oh. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> yeah, I don't need your borders anymore, thanks. Ow! Oh, no! Ow! That's not nice. That was not nice. <clears throat> oh, I should have known better than put him there. Well, that's one really nice Gatling gun gone. Oh, well. That hurts, but at least they're going to be less... They were less becoming less and less of a backbone of my army anyway. So it's not a devastating loss. I just feel really dumb for letting it happen, as they may think. As I should, it was pretty stupid. So let's see if Mr. Great War Bomber can deal with his four legions. Or a four legion, anyway. Uh, there we go. Alright, and the artillery you can smack that guy up now. That's good. Right, let's do this, actually. Um, he can't get over there in time. Okay, this guy can. He can block that off with him. Oh, uh, we can almost take Leon this turn, but I don't want to do that. Because he might come take it back somehow. He might be able to spam enough cannon and stuff in there to actually take it down. Oh, I can't believe I got that Gatling gun killed off. Derp. Oh, hey. What's up? <laughs> I had the Great War Bomber appeared to support him here. Um, oh, this guy's over in Helsinki. He doesn't have range, though, so he's kind of useless here. Come on. There we go. Pick him. Yeah. But even if he had range, he would, he'd be useless still. <laughs> so I guess kind of a point. Can you actually take this guy out this turn? Yes, you can. Nice. So, yeah, killing off four legions is nice, because they're 50 gold apiece, so... It's a lot more gold. Um, I right, find that hill. Sorry, no, as long as Napoleon doesn't, like, buy up Laventa two turns until that road's done, then we'll be good there. And I think he's actually running out of money to uh, buy city-states with. I mean, he could always coup, but they don't have any allies, so he's not going to coup. Oh, yeah, let's move this artillery over. Uh, let's just leave you in the city. I don't want to take any chances here. Oh, Kathmandu. China went grab Kathmandu, I guess. They're sh Lexus shenanigans or whatever. Ooh, hey, he grabbed the artillery. There you go. And now I know what it feels like to be the AI with bombers, while the human players are the other person has artillery. Kind of feel like kind of a dick. Kind of feel like he deserves it too. So, <laughs> just saying. All right, we got Leon, and what the hell? Why is Notre Dame here? Why is that under capital? I mean, it didn't make a difference. I just figured it'd be in his capital, but okay. <laughs> well, there's ten free happenings right there. Um, yeah, you can see the five. I'm not sure, I don't remember if that's a net gain or a loss or whatever. Let's see, um, these guys can switch around, because you can smack that rifleman down a little bit. And you can actually kill that rifleman off. There you go. Uh, he should be good. He has, oh, he doesn't have cover too. Well, he's in open territory though, so. The Gallius kills him off though, like, after like, Seppuku. It'll be kind of a really, really dumb if that happens. <laughs> I don't think it will, but you know. My luck. Eh. Alright, let's get these great war bombers in here. I don't know if I want to take them to start chartreuse yet. I think we should wait one turn to do that. So once we have some artillery support here. It may sound like me like one guy. That's like support. Um, let's see, you'd be 78, 88 if I move a mana game. Let's switch these guys around. 
And yeah, actually, these guys didn't really matter. They just need to stay there. I do need to get general in here though, so he can have the uh, general support next turn. That guy should be okay. I hope he's okay. I'll be a little sad if he's not. <laughs> What the hell? Was really? Washington's gonna try to vulture him? Seriously? Like, why? I could see Solomon, but... No. Also, Washington sucks. What's he gonna do? <laughs> He's about as bad off as Napoleon is down here. I just don't get it. Well, oh, whatever, it's the AI. I guess certain things you're not supposed to get. <laughs> Uh, this may be a little goofy doing this, but oh well. Uh, I might lose one of these guys, but meh. Not the end of the world if I do. He gets these guys done faster, which is the important thing. Let's throw you on the hill there. Uh, let's put you there. And you can't get over there, by the way. Although, we wouldn't need to, because that would be in range of Paris, which is up to 95 defense. Oof. And let's see if we can bomb these four legions to pieces. Probably not quite, but... Um, actually, I would rather bomb the artillery pieces first. Probably for the best that way. And yeah, let's actually not screw up with the Gatling gun. Uh, horns away again. I did that once. You think I would have learned? <laughs> I'm not doing that again. Is this guy out of range? The cannon? Yes, he is. He's just out of range. Mm. What's well, like that for, Legion, then? And let's see this guy up here this way. Alright. So. And then we have money. I'm trying to think what I could do with this money is the thing. Do you want to save it for upgrades? Do you want to buy some more units? Do you want to buy some city states up? Or what do you want to do? Um, I think. Let's see, check out Florence. Yeah, Florence wants money. Although 103 bucks. Oof. I could drop a thousand bucks on them, but that's kind of a at this point in the game. Uh, if I need that much culture, <laughs> that I'm gonna get from uh, these guys. Uh, where's Bru yeah Brussels? Uh, 23 influence. When's the next election ring? Oh, a couple turns. Okay. How the coup is there percent? Eighty-five percent. Yeah, I'm a human player though, so it's eighty-five percent with a eighty-five percent penalty. I do not like doing coups because I haven't made that clear enough. All right, you guys can all just wait it out here. Actually, let's have you remove some of these stupid farms. I don't think it'd be that much good, but I don't want to have gigantic puppets going around here. Ooh, wow. <laughs> yeah, he almost didn't make it out of that, but he made it out of it. So, yeah, I was afraid to lose this guy. But I think he can actually get it. Well, maybe he can't. Well, maybe he can. Because if he heals the march. Uh, yeah, let's just take a look at this. Uh, yeah, there's Dito, Solomon, and basically everyone else. <laughs> I'm kind of up here. I guess there's kind of. There's D2, then there's me, and then there's everyone else basically lumped together. Okay, social policies. Um, yeah, order. I need the happiness. That's about all I can say about that. I said, thought I'd like an autocracy to, you know, mess around. Yeah, in this particular case, I can't really afford it to do that, I don't think. Because, like I said, Sullivan is probably going to hit my guts if I did that more than he already does. Uh, let's see, you're, yeah, you're 25 HP, you run away with 35. This medic is back here with you, you'd be. It's not a medic. Yeah, he is now. <laughs> I mean, he's drafted. Especially having some of these artillery pieces try to shoot this these guys down. Um, actually, it's a better idea. Let's... Yeah, uh, yeah, you're almost... That guy's almost gonna die if he attacks again, so... Blah. 
Okay, we kill that Great War Infantry off, that's good. Let's try and smack this guy. Okay, we can. Right, will he do enough to... Yes, he will. Okay, good. I think I think only think we will do there for this turn. Uh, yeah, this guy will. Oh, what is that guy gonna do? Yeah, he can stick there, I guess. Actually, he should probably pillage that that to heal up a little bit. And he'll smack our treads. If I lose one of these guys, it's worth trading the uh, a great overtree for uh, Chartres there. That's definitely worth it, in my opinion. And let's slide this guy to take a cannon out. Or not quite take it out, but get close. Yeah, let's just keep removing these uh, farms while I can. Leon, Leon is it? Yeah, well, it's still six food, but. Okay, well, let's. While we're at it, let's start moving some of uh, these great war infantry in here. Let's get the general down here. Since a lot of his. I just saw his pointy sticks running and it's really bad. <laughs> This is pretty pretty much a great time to move in here and start trying to kick him in the head before he rebuilds everything. Let's see. Yeah, I probably don't even need to bring the great the uh, Gatling gun in here, to be honest. But I probably will anyway, just out of habit. Let's actually let's have this guy get across the water, just because I don't want to have risk him getting uh, hit by that four legion. It may be the end of him. Because this guy's got open terrain. This guy's got rough, so. Oof. Alright, you go trading push that hill. Maybe he'll finally work that tile. St st puppet not working any production tiles. Bull. Okay. Uh, we built Christian with that door. Okay. Don't really care. Looks a failure. Rig, okay, so it was like two for four or something. Yay, bug orbit three and air repair. You know what comes out for that? Logistics. Yay. So I think we actually. Oh, I think the attack would actually do it. Alright, so what do we have in here? Um, ooh, no happiness buildings. That's not cool. That's not cool at all. Kind of puts me right on the edge of no happiness. We didn't have any of its happiness buildings staying intact. That sucks. <laughs> that really sucks. Okay, just sucked all the happiness out of order from me. Although I'm kind of thinking... I think I want to try and do something kind of stupid, but kind of awesome at the same time. And try to use this deer for... Oh, well that's nice. They wanted to see my engineer. Oh, in that case, uh, Florence, you're 61 influence. Uh, let's do, I'll just do that. Yay. Uh, it was just stupid stuff that I read earlier about the, that. So fortune turns delicate to plant economy, that's nice. Or maybe humanism. Because, again, happiness is an issue. Because you gotta think about it, if, I go unhappy, it's basically minus 70% science because of the rationalism opener, which requires you to be the empire to be in happiness. That's the only problem with that. Um, not going with happiness policies if you're going that route. Actually, no, you need to get back there. This guy still can't shoot that Kenny Kenny. No, they can't. One tile off. Actually, yeah, that's. No, you can't shoot it over the forest. What am I doing? I'm wasting everyone's time is what I'm doing, <laughs> apparently. Yeah, I don't really care about the super cannon, actually. I can just totally ignore it. It does, like, two damage. No exaggeration. That's still with the food. Yeah, it's food. It's still got those annoying tiles over there. So I try to sometimes try to pillage tiles before I take the city, but it doesn't always occur to me to do so. So, let's just have you guys at least bomb or leans. Well, you, anyway. Bomb Orleans. That timer's going off, so we'll do a couple of turns. I want to take Orleans before the next fray in this video. Um, 
trade of interest to you? Uh, no, because you might be my launching point into Dio. Uh, oh, Monaco, I don't care. I thought it was Milan, I have to flip a table. It's like, I've already lost one stupid city to a stupid coup, I don't need to go lose more of them. Ooh, I'm glad I wasn't going for Statue of Liberty. <laughs> With that engineer, because I've been trolled. Well, I now actually I hadn't burned it yet. I have had situations where I have burned an engineer on a wonder, and then it disappears between turns. Like, the turn I built, I burned the engineer, and it makes me want to flip tables so fucking hard. You don't even know. <laughs> okay, so Orleans... Uh, let's actually grab that worker. Settler, whatever. Now it's a worker. And else is mine. Damn. Now Orleans is mine. Um, yes, yeah, made me unhappy. And I kept the Coliseum in the theater, at least. So the city didn't suck. Keeping its stuff intact. Uh, so yeah, that does put it at minus three. But, 13 turns I'll have humanism, so if I can just stay afloat until then. Um, okay, yeah, so you put the great warfare in the city, that's two. Uh, what is this cannon doing here? Really? So, yeah, I have a couple of, uh, p three potential happiness here from garrisons. Uh, I think this city is a theater you can still build, yeah. So a theater I can build. Well, Eiffel Tower is coming, I forgot about that. So Eiffel Tower can take care of that happiness for the moment, anyway. Yeah, let's just kill this cannon off. Ah, uh, yeah, you can shoot there. There we go. Look at the bombers, can they do anything interesting? I think we'll pull that guy up, that's about it. So let's move them up here to Orleans. Because in the next video we're going to take Paris. So yeah, this did this was a very time-consuming war, but because as you saw, <laughs> the French went to just spam and spam and spam units at me endlessly, and it takes a while to kind of just you know break the back of that spam and finally get in there where you can say, hey, <laughs> I'm gonna kill you and you can't stop me now. <laughs> so, um, oh actually, I guess I could have bombed this guy. I think he's surrounded enough, maybe. Nah. <laughs> he's probably gonna run away the water next turn. That'll be kinda of funny to see. Okay, so um yeah, we'll go ahead and end the turn, we'll start with the next one. Just get this over with. Yep. Yeah. Oh, really? The Gallius? Four damage from the Gallius. If they were did more damage than the cannon, that's the part I like. <laughs> that's kinda dumb. Uh, hey, 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 uh, 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 you are not taking things apart from me, buddy. Any influence, really? Oh, well, he wants a road, though, so I can do that. But, problem is, yeah, I'm at minus ten in the meantime. That is gonna suck. So, I at least need to get above that. Um, can we train anything? Trade luxuries are at all? Anything? Hey, Washington, I think. You don't have money, but you wanted some like, stuff, right? Yeah, you don't have any extra stuff, is the problem. Yeah. You don't have stuff. Well, you have ivory, but you don't want any like, extra stuff, is the problem. Actually, yeah, I do have spare cotton, because, um. Uh, I'm getting it from Milan, so I do have extra cotton. Actually, I had this cotton here too, but I pillaged it, so I'm gonna go fix that with the, this worker right here. Okay, so before I get too far into this, we're above the happiness, the minus 10 Eiffel Tower will get us to a decent amount. Uh, I'll get Zanzibar back, I'll build a road there for their quest. And that should get me back to that point, so that'll be good. So I'm gonna leave it here. See you guys, episode 10.